Okay, so it's March 4th, and you are? March 14th, right? No, March 4th. Or March 4th. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's one, one of them. Okay, and what's your name? My name is Daniel Henry. This is a 1912 rotary spark gap transmitter. And this is a smaller version of what they would have had on board the Titanic. And we'll pretend it's 1912 and we struck an iceberg. And I'm in the wireless room and I'll send out the SOS. All right. Here we go. Now, would they need something that big to receive that? No, you could be listening on your, you could be listening on the wireless receiver. Ah. Here, something like this, and this one has a crystal in it. And you would pick up the message and listen on your earphones. And so Sparky actually referred to, to this <laughs> yeah. device, okay. Sparky or Sparks. And how long did these rule the waves? What they used them on was they used them on ships up, up until World War II. And by that time, they were kind of a backup, but they did use them for quite some time. So no voices yet. <laughs>